the last skincare video I did a few months ago got a lot of love from you guys. So what next? Today I am back with another very amazing skincare routine but for this season. Hello and welcome to Body A to Z. And this week the spotlight is on summer skincare. While we have fully transitioned into our summer vibe, eating summer fruits, wearing summer clothes, working out for that summer body, it is also important to change our skincare routine to suit our skin's need in this very hot and humid time. Today, we'll be discussing about a step-by-step -step summer skincare routine to protect and rejuvenate your skin this summer. Product number one. Cleanser. The first step to summer skincare is cleansing your skin to get rid of all the dirt and grime and remove any excess oil that gets deposited on the face and in the pores. Use a mild alcohol free face wash that suits your skin and clean it well two to three times a day. If you have full face of makeup on or sunscreen then don't directly use a cleanser. Remove makeup first using a micellar water or oil or water-based makeup remover then followed by a gentle cleanser to clean any toxins that might be remaining on your skin. Product number two, swap your moisturizer. Winter face creams are made from heavy creams and oils to lock the moisturizer in throughout the day and to hydrate your face during the dry months. But that's exactly what you don't need in summers. Make sure you pick an oil-free, light-based or water-based moisturizer that nourishes and hydrates your face without clogging the pores. Product number 3. Sunscreen Applying sunscreen is one of the most important steps in your summer skincare routine. Although doctors suggest that wearing sunscreen is important all around the year, it is especially very very important to do so during summers. The scorching hot sun can leave your skin feeling dehydrated. Sunscreen helps provide a shield across the skin against the sun. Furthermore, prolonged exposure to the sun and its UV rays can damage the skin cells and speed your aging process. That is where sunscreen comes to play. Sunscreen helps in preventing aging and protects your skin from any of the issues that sun and its UV rays might cause. Product number 4. Exfoliation We all know how the pollution and dirt from outside affects our hair and skin. Therefore, exfoliation is a great way to keep your skin pores clean, strip away the dry, dead skin from the pores and promote healthy, glowing and radiant, oil-free skin. You can exfoliate the skin by using gentle scrubs. Make sure to not overdo the exfoliation as it might tear your skin's tissues and make it more prone to absorbing dirt and toxins. Excessive exfoliation can also cause more inflammation and acne to appear on the face. Therefore, be very cautious of what exfoliation product you are using, whether it's a peel, scrub or the new chemical exfoliators that are available in the market. And also do not exfoliate for more than twice in a week. Product number fifth, be mindful about your makeup. Wearing lesser makeup makes your skin breathe easily, especially during these very long and hot days. When wearing heavy foundation-based makeup can make your skin more itchy, sticky and sweaty. Therefore, choose moisturizers instead that are tinted and have SPF 30 or more in it as it will provide that makeup finish look on your face without adding any extra layer and will also protect from the sun damage. If not, then choose makeup wisely. Choose the products that are broad spectrum, lightweight and have SPF in them. Product number 6, Lip Balm. How can we talk about skin care and face care and forget my favourite product of all, Lip Balm? I see most people missing out on a very essential part of their skin care, that is caring for their lips. Rubbing your tongue over your lips is not a substitute for Lip Balm and it spoils and dries out the skin faster than ever. Always keep a Lip Balm with yourself and make sure that during this season your Lip Balm also has SPF in it. 
as it will protect your lips from UV damage. Reapply lip balm as many times in a day as you like. And don't forget to apply on the outer corners of your lips and not just the inner corners. Last product, face masks. Face mask is another great way of protecting, nourishing and hydrating your skin. These days, face masks are infused with all sorts of skin-boosting nutrients like niacinamide, vitamin C, E, A. Therefore, choose a mask that's good for your skin. While store-bought face mask is also good, but making face masks at your home makes the whole process more fun and enjoyable. Making face masks infused with yogurt, lemon, honey or other refreshing ingredients will help rejuvenate your skin. These are some of the easy tips that you can follow in order to have a healthy skin. You can include these steps if you want a more elaborated skincare routine. You can also add serums, toners, under eye creams for your nighttime routine. But make sure that whatever product you add are skin friendly and not made of very harsh chemicals. Also, don't forget to drink plenty of water as the easiest and the best way to have a glowing face is by drinking plenty of water. That's it for this week. I'll see you next week.